Hi, Seth from Sealrite Corporation, manufacturers of the Packrite bearing and high performance rate of packing, here for the pump seal channel to discuss tools, specifically tools for installation and removal of packing in a stuffing box. It doesn't matter if it's a centrifugal pump, if, if it's a piston pump, if it's a valve, anytime you have to remove packing from a stuffing box. There are certain tools that will greatly help you. Now, there are people who will just about use anything to remove packing, screwdrivers, hammers, things of that nature. And while they may be useful, there are some tools out there that will make your life a lot easier and get the job done a lot faster. So one of the few things that we feel you should have in your toolbox, starting from left to right, my left, your right, uh, obviously a good packing knife. Something used to cut your bulk packing, cut packing to size on the job or in a setting where you prep your rings. Other tools that we like to have are measuring tools. So I have a ruler here with a slide rule and these are snap gauges. We always try to stress that whenever you are installing or removing packing to just double check your dimensions, especially after you've moved the packing, you think there might be obstructions, you're not sure if everything is cleared out of there. Getting in there and taking all of your measurements is paramount to proper performance, no matter what type of packing you're, you're putting in there. So as far as removal goes, we have two different, what's called Bruno's picks right here. Obviously there's a rubber tip on these. And if you are a man and remove it, as you can see, it's a sharp little pick, very useful getting in there and getting some of those stubborn packing rings out of the stuffing box. One of the first tools that we do use though, however, is an extractor. As you can see, I have several different types of extractors. It's all based on what the cross section of the packing is, how deep you need to get into that stuffing box. As you can see, it has a corkscrew tip with a T-handle. Basic motion is just drive that into the packing, grab hold of your T-handle and pry the packing out. Easier said than done. However, these tools will make it very, very easy for you to do so. Another variation on this is a solid shaft extractor here for the really resilient packings that uh, just seem to be a real pain in the knobs trying to, trying to take out. And as with every single one of these extractors, the tip is removable. These do snap, they do break. It's just the, the nature of the beast. Um, so be prepared to always have extra, extra corkscrews in your toolbox. As far as other tools that you can use for extraction, we don't have them represented here. A good flashlight and a mirror. Uh, I use a dental mirror, a little bit larger, actually an automotive mirror. Um, that way I can shine in and I can actually see that the, the, uh, the stuffing box is clear. Um, other things you can use, wire brushes, things like that, that just kind of clean out that stuffing box. When it comes to installation, some tools that we use uh, right here, these are our tamping tools. As you can see, there's varying sizes to these as well, depending on the cross section of your packing. Seating every ring is paramount when it comes to putting packing back into the pack box. Just driving it in and then hitting your gland follower every time and pushing each subsequent ring in using that gland follower is not the way to do it. You want positive mating of those surfaces with each ring. So it's imperative that you seat each ring. These tools right here will go a long way to helping you do that, as will these here. And these are just a plastic sheet that have been cut. And what this allows you to do is actually curve this around the shaft like such. Cut it to length, bring this around the shaft, and that will also help you push the packing in down to the bottom of the box. These come in varying cross sections here, varying lengths and widths as well, depending on the size of packing that you are using. So, some, all of these tools will be helpful when it comes to removing and installing packing. We highly suggest that you pick up some, and hey, guess what? You can pick them up from Sealrite. So, inquire within. If I missed any tools, anybody has any other suggestions, please give us some feedback and we'll be happy to add them to uh, add them to the video in the future. And in the future, I will be using these so people can actually see 
how you properly use these tools. I'm Seth from the Pump Seal channel. Thank you very much.